It's the greatest day ever. Welcome to the watch. <laughs> Dude, I'm having fun already just sitting here. I know, right? Hey, okay. we're going we're to think that Kirby Taco, you do it because I'm, I'm Yoda. Can, can you do it as Yoda? I can do it. <laughs> can you yeah. even understand me? Mm, thank Kirby Crackle, we do. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Check out more Kirby Crackle at KirbyCracklemusic.com. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, where we are. That's we, good. We, we okay. together. <laughs> we're, we're at, um, <laughs> we're at Carrie's, <laughs> we're at Carrie's costumes and say, boys. Oh, Carrie's man. Costumes, yeah. Mm-hmm. Yes, we're yeah. at Carrie's costumes. <laughs> I can't take Ron fun. seriously yeah. at all right now. You could before? No. Maybe. No, I couldn't. <laughs> What do we got coming up on tonight's show? Uh, so first up, we, we've got uh, an applied makeup of... Elven ear tips. We were going to show Ooh. you a quick demo on how to apply, um, yeah, an ear tip. I get an ear. Woo! So exciting. So uh, we have the Wuchi ear tips in our store. They come in different sizes. So you get a large ear tip, small, uh, just depends on the look you're going for. So if we were doing it today... So typically in a kit, you get the spirit gum and the spirit gum remover. Spirit gum, I have one right here. It's a tree resin skin adhesive. So it's very easy to use. We're going to do it on your... I can move. I can take it all off too if you want. If you know what? I can Ooh, probably... take it all off. I can probably <laughs> work around this. Sweet. <laughs> so spirit gum's really easy to use. You would just put a little bit... I know, sorry, we, I have two lefts here. So you would put a little bit on the ear, and the thing with spirit gum is you just have to tap it to activate it. So at first it's really slippery. After a couple seconds, feel good? It starts good? to get tacky. I like yep, it. Yep, you can sticky. see. It gets sticky, icky. It gets matte, and my finger <laughs> starts sticking like that. You want to always start with an ear tip at the front, because if you have too much um, prosthetic left, you want it to bunch in the back so you don't see that mistake. Mm. So after the spirit gum's on there, I probably should have, you know, seen where I was going to put this first. Oh, 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 oh. Now it comes with the remover, so if you do a little bit of a mistake, it's easy to fix. So then we're just going to tap it down. Now, Woochie's a really good brand because the edges are super thin, so it looks like it dissolves right into your skin. Um, If you have a different appliance that the edge is really thick, you just get some liquid latex on a sponge and you just fill in the edge with it. So it's a little bit more work, but you get a seamless application. So then you would just continue on. We got the front going. I can work at the back um, while they're talking about other stuff, but that's really it. Then you just want to color it. So if you want to look more real, you could add some foundation. You can take a stipple sponge and add some red and some brown, like the actual colors of your skin. And, uh, but that's pretty much it. So I'll finish this up. Afterwards, if you wanted, you can use some translucent powder and a powder puff just to, just to take away some of the shine. That's about it. That's very cool. Sweet. Yeah. Yes. We'll do a little okay. bit more in the morning. So face. last week we were at Game Over. Yeah, and that was, VR. that was a lot of fun. I got to tell you a story. Um, had so much fun. The next day, my wife and I bought the PlayStation VR headset. What? And how does it compare to what they have there? Um, my wife actually hasn't let me play it yet. I haven't gotten near it. Oh, okay. <laughs> so I'll let you know once I'm allowed to try it. But it looks okay. pretty sweet. You guys made it sound so um, awesome, by the for way. For those of it's you really that uh, maybe missed I the episode, Game oh. VR is celebrating their one-year anniversary by giving away an Oculus Go uh, to one of their lucky winners. Yeah, that's a pretty uh, sweet All prize. you have to do is follow them on Facebook. Um, for all the contest uh, deals leading up to the big celebration on July 28th. Uh, so all you have to do is, uh, on July 28th, head down to uh, St. Albert on uh, Hebert Road. Um, I believe they're number one on the building. I think they're number one. I think one. that is. They're, they're yeah. right there in the corner. There. Yeah, it's yeah. pretty easy it's to It's right find. next to the liquor store if, you're, if you need a giant, a giant liquor, liquor store. store. Yes, yeah. um, they have a bunch of door prizes for the first 50 people through the door as Ooh. well. Yeah, like a little gift grab bag. And they, they also said, like, have special prizes like special pricing the whole yeah. prizes this thing's getting me it's getting um, me but yeah so like definitely check out again game ovr they're awesome i had a blast there oh, uh, I, I got to too, play yeah. like the zombie game the multiplayer thing like the first time we went we didn't play multiplayer no so it was kind of neat to play multiplayer how late did you guys stay there no we didn't stay very you late. didn't stay very long no i just played a couple more of the lightsaber because i liked it, it a it lot was fun, so. yeah 
And don't forget too to check it out there on, on Tuesdays because they got the twenty dollars Tuesdays for twenty bucks. You get an hour of uh, VR gaming, which is a pretty, or pretty if you sweet have deal. three friends and yourself. It's only eighteen seventy five for all four of you to show up each for an yeah. hour. For an hour, for which yeah, is the best deal. Sweet. And yeah, then you like play it. your own game. Okay, oh, let's do We're this. Gonna cut on. to a. Uh... Hold on, let's do this right now. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> we're going to cut to an ad in fashion here. Watch this. And uh, to commercial break we go. Saint Albert isn't just a great place to raise a family. It's not just about the numerous natural areas or the conveniently located amenities. St. Albert is about the community, the neighbors, and the families. St. Albert is home. Hi, I'm Kim Opelinski. Living and loving St. Albert for over 30 years. I'd love to help you buy or sell a home. Um, <laughs> um, um, Peter Mayhew. Nothing. Uh, Nothing? Nothing. I can see nothing. <laughs> <laughs> so and yet I'm are having these, the... Are these the droids you're looking for then? <clears throat> um, possibly. As I said, I can't see anything. You're doing it wrong. Am I? Yeah. It's... Oh yeah, I can't make that noise unless I have a cold. Oh, okay. Yeah. <laughs> I can't see anything. I'm still having the best time ever down here at Carrie's Costumes in St. Albert. And... Uh, this head I'm wearing, there's a whole costume that comes with it, and you can rent the whole costume. It's so lush. We have a rental and a purchase. So oh, so it's for rent and you, for purchase. Yeah, so you can get one that no one else has sweat in before, <laughs> which is pretty nice, probably. Yeah, lots of great <laughs> costumes down here. So much fun in this place. I am, I'm never going to leave. I don't know what I am. I'm some kind of elf skipper orc. It, it works for it's, you. Um, the, fan a, the fantasy version of Gilligan's Island, I guess. He's the bargain I don't shop. Know. You're like sitting there with, uh, uh, what would Ginger be, a fairy or something? Uh, I like this. I like where you're you going know, with that. Like. Uh, the professor would probably be like... He's a wizard. An elf or a wizard, yeah. Yeah, totally a wizard, yeah. Wizard, yeah. Gilligan yeah. is like a Gilligan bard. Gilligan would be... No. Je no? No. Jester? No. What would he be? I don't know. Anyway. I got nothing. But, okay. So coming up in a couple okay. weeks here, we have Animathon, and uh, some of the biggest things I got to kind of put out there. PSA, bro. This is a dance. Why is there a guy's butt on this? Well, There's a guy's it, butt on this. It's, I mean, so, it shows yeah. your. Like, um, but you don't have to get the thong version. You can get the yeah, the, the, the full butt cover too. So if you don't want the uh, the, thong, the thong, sumo thong, wrestler thong. look. You can uh, get the, the butt cover. I think it's supposed to be more comfortable for you. I think it's more comfortable, more comfortable yeah. either way or hide something better. Well. I'm not too sure. Um, Keegan you don't get the panty lines. Uh, was actually pretty yes. good and uh, told me a little bit about, about this. So, no, it's 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 good. It hides your 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 tiddly bits. But you can get that here at Carrie's Costumes. Yes, and that yeah, and, and definitely, uh, you guys, spandex. If you're wearing them, you know, have some some. And Carrie's Costumes is also looking into getting a uh, couple different styles. So if you have one that these guys don't have and you, you wouldn't mind showing them off to kind of <laughs> give them uh, a, a demo of how yours works and why you like it better than maybe, say, this one, uh, they're more than willing to uh, listen to your thoughts. I mean, it's, it's, it's helpful you know. for them. You realize you just told people to come down yeah. and show off their That's what I heard. They're dancer belts. Just come show your dancer belts clean. off. You know, it's clean. Don't be, yeah. Maybe not wearing Don't, don't show off your jock strap like, you know, like, like most of those famous, like, Football players do, and, and, after, you know, and then suddenly it became a less. I'm not a. Fun I'm not a. I'm work. not a jock. I don't understand how that stuff works. So, I don't know what to say to that. <laughs> I really don't. Uh, but okay, so like with Animathon coming up, um, there's lots of stuff in here. So like, if you're one of the anime guys that likes to change your eyes, uh, you can like black them out. Here. You can uh, do the Resident Evil look. Um, I'm not sure if you guys have the sharing gun like Naruto eyes. No. 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 But. Can you get them? Pro, we'll look into that. I think they're this brand. Is it? Well, then, I'm pretty sure they have this brand. And what the, is it? It's the, the showering gun, and the they've got like all sorts of eyes from Naruto. Oh. So if you guys have possibilities, but this one looks like a straight out of Resident Evil, so that's actually pretty cool. And then I was but checking you guys can out. always come in and, and ask, and we will order. Okay. So we definitely have a catalog and stuff. Yeah, but the more you ask, the more we'll this, bring these in. Guys carry it. Then I'm sure. I'm sure. <laughs> and then also, like I say, even for casual cosplayers, if you're not. You know, if you're going to an anime thon or even a convention, they got things like this here, a quick little link set with some ears and a hat. Yeah, like ears can just 
this pop is, on and off. This is where it starts for a lot of I people. It's something like this, and then you can build on from <laughs> off of this and up from there. And oh, the one I'm thing I wanted apart. to mention is, is yeah, <laughs> your ears you got there. And the wire ones here so like some are a little people, different than yeah. what Josh has got on. So she's got the ones that are going to be like <laughs> kind of permanent for the day, whereas mine can just be pop on and off. On and and these off. are the same like ones in the, in the package here, right? They're no, these are. Um, no, nope, those these ones just fit on top. Just fit over just fit top, top yeah. kind of like Kyle's. These ones fit over top. These ones actually like you can bend this to form your ear. So if you want your ear to stick out this way, like mine did, you can bend it properly. If you want to sit conformed and like flat. You bend it that way and it sits more kind of like the same. yeah so it just well no it's just it's because i haven't really really <laughs> played with it but yeah yes yes you, you, our like, customers it's really like blowing my mind bro it's, it's like silly putty i know right it's actually kind of cool like really cool. Um, really and then well. of course they've also got like all this um like this is pretty cool i i just kind of picked this up off the shelf because it looked cool but it actually blended with my beard really well too. It did, yeah. I could hardly <laughs> I was tell. Like, I, would, I, would. I was like, hey, this is this is familiar. But, just, but this yeah. reminds me kind of like not just of an orc, but you guys remember the the labyrinth Ludo? Mm. Oh, oh yes, of this course, reminds yeah, me of Ludo. Yeah, absolutely. So, yeah, those yeah. Are just like those. It, it looks are. like Ludo, so I thought that was pretty Maybe cool. Um, Ludo. Nice throwback. So I like another that. one is if you're doing anime, a popular character, One Punch Man, you need a bald cap. Uh, they got bald caps. Um, there's actually like everything you would need in here. In yeah. the back here, like everything uh, you need. Same brand. And it does come, it's the same brand, so just really great brand. Yeah, it's a really good brand. It's back. It's all fine. It's a good I, brand. Steve's, Steve's, Steve's waving around there. I don't know if you're... Oh, yeah, I see. You're Kyle. too fast. He's just so, and we can explain how to use it, because there is quite a bit that goes into one of these, but our yeah. staff, you know, we've applied them. They're fun, so we can explain everything to you. Even with the ears, um, you know, if you needed extra hold, let's say you were wearing it for, you know, uh, you know, 16 hours, there's little tips and tricks we can teach you. You can put, you can take apart a Q-tip and put some of that cotton in between the spirit gum and your appliance, and it's going to last that much longer. So, wow. would there be a benefit, um, I have a bald friend asking, mm -hmm. w would it be beneficial for him to maybe get this to maybe just hide the little stubble he possibly has? So I didn't have to keep it clean shaven all day. Oh, uh, Would he benefit from that? This, I mean, this takes a little bit of time to put on. Okay. So uh, it would be quicker just to do a quick. Yeah, just a quick shave. Yeah, it would. Okay. By a big Andrew. And so no if Andrew. he never no. can get his hair that you know it's short, he grows it back really quick. Or same with beard. There's something called beard stubble um, concealer. It's bright orange. You what? put it on. Uh, yeah, if you put on your five o'clock shadow, and it looks bright orange, and then you cover it up with a foundation. And it will hide it the whole day. Wow. Yeah. So yeah, we do things like that. Oh. Dude, that's too much stubble. Yeah. Thing, stubble is <laughs> the beard. <laughs> hey, Dave, so there thanks are things. for tuning in. Yeah, I, I know how you suffer in the Vader costume. You don't have to tell me. <laughs> I understand. It's all good. Yeah. Um, so yeah, like, like definitely come down and get some stuff like for the um, for the Amazon coming up because. I mean, hey, like, like it's costumes. I mean, you go and do cosplay. You want to go out and have fun. You just want something possibly like a, a con-friendly sword. This is this is foam. This is this is con-friendly, and we'll it looks like something you know. In just a sec here. We're, we're, right now, we're gonna jump away uh, for a promo video for our friends over at Put the Screws On, right, Steve? So yeah, we we'll check that out. We'll be back. We'll talk more about weapons. Shink. <laughs> My name is Alicia Snyder. I'm the producer and quiz master for a new show at the Grindstone Theatre. It's a comedy trivia show called Put the Screws On. It happens uh, the fourth Wednesday of every month at 7 p.m. You can get tickets at the Grindstone or online at uh, grindstonetheatre.ca. So the theme for the pilot show is aviators. And uh, we're going to have questions about sunglasses, pilots, famous crashes, uh, Jules Verne, anything that has to do with anything that flies. Oh, right okay, never mind. Support local comedy. All right, and uh, what do you got there, buddy? Support local comedy, July 25th, 7 p.m. Tickets are 12 bucks, or you can win them today. We're giving them away. <laughs> yeah, we're giving away. We got four tickets here. Uh, if you and your buddies would like to go, uh, let's see some hashtags. Put Put the screws on. Hashtag put the screw on. Put the screws on. Hashtag put the screws on. And then just uh, like the page and share this video. And we'll uh, we'll give them away really quick here uh, by the end of the show. So stick around. Yeah, and, and that's, we'll give you uh, tickets away. That's right. It's at the new Grindstone uh, Theater. We'll do two there. bundles. So two, two and two. Two and two. So two yeah. doubles. Two doubles. So show. if you guys want to win these tickets, uh, they're generally 12 bucks. 7 p.m. July 
25th. That's a Wednesday at 7 p.m. And uh, I'll be there. Jocelyn will be there. Ron, you going to go? I'm going to try and make it, but I have my in-laws coming next oh, week. Oh, okay. So, That's okay. Yes. Well, need, I'm going to be going, so go hashtag that, put the screws on. Live from Carrie's Cautions, that's where we are. Yes, yes. That, that's where right. we are. Yeah. We're live at Carrie's Cautions. <laughs> I'm, I'm not live. I'm... You're undead? Yeah. Well, I'm kind of like Memorex. Memorex? Are you with the Force? <laughs> yes, that's it. That's How did it. you know? Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Figure sure. it out. I love where we sat here. It's, you guys are lucky that I faced the camera for tonight's show. I could have just <laughs> turned around and just stared at the wall. <laughs> yeah, you would have. You I totally have a feeling I'm going to spend money before I leave here. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I better hope my wife didn't did. watch that part. <laughs> I did. <laughs> hey, so anyways, you were talking about weapons things. before we went to that promo ad. Actually, we got a question. Do we oh. have morph suits in black? We do. We do. Ooh, so is right this there, is like this magic. a morph suit or is this like a body suit? So this is a body suit. We do carry the morph suits as well, but um, people are really liking these ones size-wise. This is a dance brand, Body Wrappers. So is that going to fit a guy my size? I, not this one right I here, no. Oh, no. Like, I, like, do I, I get it I got money in my pocket right now to see you try that This on one's an extra life. small. But <laughs> extra and then we do have the hoods, that. and yeah, we have the ones that okay, are full. Okay, sweet. Yeah, they so do right have right them. Right now, you guys want to see Kyle squeeze into an extra small uh, morph suit? Let's send in those. Yes, woo, woo. Hashtag <laughs> hell yes. Right now, do it. Oh, where's my phone? Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> you guys want me to put I will, like, destroy that thing. No. Okay. How much is it? I'll pay for it if he destroys it. That's how much I want. Oh, you to get. can't. It's it's like a lycra or something. It's fifty nine. Oh, come I on. Can't destroy it. No, it's probably it's impossible. This is this is well made. Ladies and gentlemen, this show can if get really do, good. If you do, it's hashtag okay. It's on Carrie's. <laughs> there we go. See, you hear see, that? If you wreck it, Carrie's is always for a good time. It's okay. <laughs> See, should I go put this on? I, I, I yeah. Even oh the producer saying. Okay, do you it. guys, you guys got the show. Keep putting that yeah, here yeah. on. Ron, it's yours. Yeah. I'm gonna go put this. I got on. the big sword. <laughs> I'm just gonna throw this, this in. This is horrible. The tree. You guys suck. Can Extra small me? morph bodysuit coming up <laughs> on Kyle small. in black. You um, guys decide. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> no, wow. yeah, no dancer belt, unfortunately. No dancer. <laughs> Kyle, <laughs> what about your PSA? Oh, well, we got a bunch your, of hell yeah over here already. You, your phone. <laughs> I told you it was there. So yeah, while Kyle's going to do that, well, we're going to check back in with Kyle, with Jocelyn. I guess I'm doing and, this. Uh, she's very sharky right now. What the I'm fuck? Very, yeah. And she's I, getting I her ears done. To. And don't forget, weapons, if you're getting looking for something for your costume. Um, here. The weapons down here, these are, of course, the foam ones that are totally con safe, and you'll have no problem getting those in. And they got lots of different selection of stuff, and they got all kinds of armor <laughs> and shields and everything in the back. Got a bunch of different Star Wars stuff from helmets and costumes to lightsabers. So lots of stuff for your costumes for upcoming events and even <laughs> Halloween coming up. Hats, tights, like everything, makeup stuff. You need to change <laughs> your skin color. They have everything, like well, the setting spray on. stuff too. You I don't know how I'm going to fit sure. here. Um, yeah, and that's one of the things that's really great about a place like Carrie's Costumes, uh, where we're live tonight, so in case you forgot. Can hey, it's Can you guys hear those, him on the mic still? I don't know if he's... Where's the front? Did he take okay, it off? Okay, okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> but um, it's, it's a great place is? to come for that finishing touch. Bag in the back. Bag in the back. That's why I tell my Bag colors. in the back, yeah. <laughs> um, it's a great place to come for that finishing touch for your costume. For that Definitely. last bit. You mean, like that last thing that sets you over the head, like the hair dye or the ears way, or yeah. that one accessory. If you're looking for it and you don't have time to make it or you don't want to try and learn how to make it, this is the place to come and check out. Because I learned my lesson with that with cosplaying. Yeah, I like to make things, but they end up costing me four times more than they would to buy. So yes. yeah, that's true. That's true. It yeah. can be that way. Yeah, sometimes. So besides you know, the rentals and the sales, do you guys do commission work and people? Will you make costumes. Oh, Jeez. <laughs> <laughs> it wow. depends. Not usually. We we have the a couple of seamstresses, but oh usually they're pretty busy with projects, dance right. season, that kind of stuff. So typically no, um, but we can usually <laughs> help help everyone out pretty well tell you where to go I got one leg in guys yeah. there's lots of or we out. have a lot of things like in. the second skin that you oh, can build upon in. right right so we have lots of basics like hat forms um, oh, yeah. um stuff like that right so okay and that's like i said too like even with the link there that oh, it's, there's things that you, that you can get to kind of build off <laughs> definitely uh, off of them and create a costume so yeah and uh oh man Steve just got a pink tutu. tutu. I think my Another is fun great. thing, though, that um, I would have loved to demo, and maybe one day we will, but it's um, laying the crepe wool. 
So uh, creating your own beard or your own sideburns or eyebrows, you know, even the Mad Hatter or something, Ooh, just with wow. some wool and that some spirit gum again. So you We know, should try that. Lot. We'll try that next time because that sounds really interesting. I'd like to check that it's out. Fun. And if we know we're doing it, I'll, I will make sure we'll get a, I'll get a clean shave going. And then I, we'll I can, we can spirit gum over top of that too. Can you? Spirit okay. gum won't rip out your hair. There's liquid latex. I wouldn't suggest putting that on okay, hair. Well, we'll make sure we stay away from <laughs> so that. maybe we'll stay away from zombie stuff. That's very good. And so, like, this guy, you're saying that like, you got the seamstresses that does some progress projects. Do you guys do work with like the theater groups here in town, with like Citadel or anything like that for big productions or anything? Not really. Uh, Citadel and a, a lot of the places you have to be part of. Um, you have to be part of oh, the union, oh um, but no, we're usually too busy here, especially in the big seasons like Halloween, and it's really just me and Leah who do it. Oh, so there the you makeup, go. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> All right, we'll be right back. Kyle is uh, it's the we'll eternal struggle, struggle on, going yeah. on, but we we got a treat coming up for you, so don't go away. We'll be right back after this ad with the watch. Every child deserves a clean, safe environment where they can learn and grow through arts, crafts, and daily activities. Every parent deserves the peace of mind knowing that they have dependable, quality childcare for their little one. Proudly servicing St. Albert families for over 18 years. Enchanted for a daycare. Yeah. Oh my God. Great hey everybody, welcome back. We are live at Carrie's Costumes here this week. And uh, we're talking to Jessica. Kyle is in the back. Um, uh, squeezing himself into um, a, something a, that's a way too small for him, <laughs> and it's coming right up. Don't forget, hey, tune in next week. We are going to be at uh, hey, the number one comic retailer in North America. That's right, our very own Happy Harbor Comics right here uh, in Edmonton. We are going to be visiting them, so check us out next week. And uh, as I said, we're here at Carrie's Costumes. We're looking at a bunch of stuff. Um, how are we doing with the ears there, like you were saying? <laughs> are we so just I, I laugh way. Don't even feel it, really, yeah. so... So I was, yeah, I didn't want to reach across and block, you know, you from doing the show. Um, but removal is really easy, especially at this point, because I've only applied so half. Cute. <laughs> but basically, the spirit gum does come with a remover, or you would just use alcohol with a little bit of a Q-tip, and you just put it on. And is that okay. with the remover, you use the Q-tip as well, just kind of along the edges yeah. to get it to release? If you want to use the earpiece again, then definitely. You just want to be delicate with it. If you use it too many times and you tear the edge, that's when you're going to want to either replace it or repair it with the liquid latex, like right. I was saying. So oh. and that's where the, the remover comes in, is that it kind of uh, extends the life of the Exactly. Of the, of the, yeah. Uh, Otherwise, okay. I know people who just I hate rip you it all. right off. Oh, but man. you look so cute. Do you want to see how far I got this thing up? Yeah, I do. <laughs> 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 and then the arm sticks out here. I that's mean, as far as I can get the thing up. That's so good. Shorter. Wow. But See, it won't so go. They're durable. It won't go. This is extra small. I actually got this past my waist. It's guys. not like see through. It's it not. Either. It's okay. It's really it's like, good. Didn't rip. I, I think. I got think sexy legs. I think this is where you need to complete the look. <laughs> you just want me to try Jeez. Just pile it on. Yes. You guys suck. That I wonder if Anne's watching. This is awesome. Anne, are you watching? Oh, I think I'm by myself. <laughs> yes, Ace Ventura. This, the later wow. years. This is everything. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> he did it. <laughs> You're having a bad hair day there, Chewy. Yeah. yeah. That's why I wear leggings. He felt like his legs felt great. That's how I feel when I'm wearing leggings. You get a good pair, they suck you in. Yeah. So I was going to ask with the ears, the, the, the extra... <laughs> yeah, so Do you trim that off or in no. the front there? Do you trim that or tuck it or cover no. it? So basically, I would just keep adhering it with the glue. Until and it, it was flat. Yeah, it just flat. disappears. Yeah, exactly. And okay. then you just work your way towards the back. And if you have any extra, then you can trim it or you can kind of bunch it, but nobody really sees that. Um, but yeah, if I actually glued it down properly, then it's, it's seamless. It's perfect. Really easy That's to do. So the cool. first time, though, I find it takes you a little bit longer, especially if you're doing it on yourself. Same with the contacts. Anyone who's coming to get contacts, it can take up to a few hours the first time to, to get them actually. If you're not used to touching there, yeah. your eye, it freaks people out. Some people. Yeah, yeah. no, it's a definitely. Yeah, so. some people are not good at that. And I know that I, I, you talk about, I, I had to wear the prosthetics ears for an audition I yeah. did. And, um, I remember yeah, getting the first one on was, was extremely difficult, you know, trying to work backwards in the mirror exactly. and figure out how to get it yeah. on. And uh, yeah, so a little bit of coaching would have been 
would have been fantastic. And that's to, what we do to here. Kind of get, a, uh, get an idea of how to And that will that. last the whole day. Um, same with some of our body paint. When you want to do the arms and the legs, we have the aqua color. So you put it everywhere and you, you can mix it with the sealant and you're good to go the whole day. It's not going to be flaking. Um, you don't have to worry about it rubbing off on your costume. So we have the stuff that will last. And the good stuff. So with yeah. stuff like that, with the body paint and mm -hmm. the coverings, how are they like what what is it what, what is it that they have is it, is it does it breathe is it is it cause skin problems with you know no being, not at all like, so it is a little bit pricier so for a little thing um it's 12.95 which to me isn't bad but to somebody who just wants some face paint um, but the reason it's that price is because it's really safe for your skin we have the two top brands used in mm -hmm. in the film industry um so really good for sensitive skin uh, it is breathable. Um, the yeah, so you so it's just it's made so it's flexible. But um, I would say we we were talking last week or when was that a month ago? I don't know. Quickly about skin prep. It's um, it's it's the same ingredient as antiperspirant. You put it on your face before you put makeup on. And it's going to okay. stop you from sweating. Okay. That's something that I would probably say not every day because that's that's not breathable. Probably not good to but block the, out every day. You yeah. know what? But it works. But the, the colors we have, they're super safe. And yeah. a little goes a long way. Like you that's say, that seems like so a lot. With the but aqua it's colors, it's not a cream where you're scooping it out. You are activating it with some water and you're taking a little bit of the pigment at a time. So, I mean, mine on average, and I do a lot of makeup, the little thing lasts me seven years. Mm -hmm. Wow. So, I mean, okay. that's, and it doesn't. So, it's, it's actually really not that expensive no. if it's something you're going to do more not than once. Totally. Yeah. And the bigger you go, you know, the more palettes you get, those, those are less in the end. Yeah. So. That's great, yeah, because that'd be a good thing if you're doing the body paint yeah. to have that, that, that sweat block, if, especially if you're, say, for uh, dark mall. Yep. Uh, for the prosthetics to stay stuck on the, on the head, because I've seen that happen with yep. the sweat starting and then the prosthetics don't want to stay totally. anymore. Totally. Mm -hmm. Yeah. But always cleaning super, before you put hard. a prosthetic on, so some 99% alcohol, you scrub that skin and get the dirt and the oils out. Okay, so before we go, guys, a couple things got to mention. Uh, this weekend, um, there is the cosplay photo shoot down at the ledge. On Sunday, yeah. On Sunday. If you guys want to check that out, that'd be awesome. Uh, secondly. We're going to uh, be there. Yeah. Well, are you coming? Uh, well, I thought we had to. Are you going to come? Yeah, we're okay. doing this thing. Yeah. Are we doing the thing? <laughs> we're going to be filming. Um, we're going to be filming. Yes. So we're going to need a bunch of you guys uh, to kind of help us out here. Um, <laughs> that, was the best, that was the best charade So if you want to be I, in I the, uh, the promo video for the watch, show up to the cosplay meet, uh, photo shoot in your cosplay, <laughs> and uh, get your photos done with everybody. And we uh, we'll be you. down there. We'll be doing some... Uh, uh, interviews and doing a pilot for a uh, uh, promo video thingy. Uh, secondly, um, this we're kind of excited about this coming up. This is kind of cool. Next week we have um, we have a Happy Harbor Comics yep. coming up. We're going to be down there, and then the following week when we're on hiatus, we have one in the bank that we just filmed. And guess what? It is on August second, and it's Doctor Susanna Flores. We got a doctor on the show. Yes, <laughs> yes, I did. We got a doctor. She's not not doctor one that just put DR in front of their name. <laughs> yeah, the actual doctor. Oh, sweet, actual doctor. Um, and uh, she wrote a book uh, called Untamed. It's um, about the psychology of Wolverine. And uh, I'm not going to ruin anything, but you can check her out on the TED Talks. A doctor who? <laughs> doctor <laughs> Susanna Flores. <laughs> yes, that's actually pretty funny. Um, but no, so yeah, you definitely check that out because it was it was an amazing interview I did today. I had a lot of fun doing that interview, and uh, I, I really can't wait for you guys to see that because uh, we we delve into a little bit of the psychology of a couple superheroes. And if you guys have a suggestion that you would like to maybe get covered after you see the episode, of maybe uh, a character you'd like to know, like. Like, I asked the question, you, um, it's a little spoiler, but I asked a question about um, Wolverine and uh, why he drinks, even though he can't actually get drunk. So you can actually find out the answer when uh, you tune in on uh, August Well, second. beer is delicious. I know, but he can't get drunk. Yeah, but beer is delicious. delicious. I know, <laughs> but he can't get drunk. But it's delicious. It but he doesn't drink beer. He drinks Some people like, can eat chocolate cake and don't get fat. That's true. Okay. <laughs> it's fair enough. Delicious. All right, it's so delicious. we're here at Carrie's Costumes. Come down, get your stuff for Animathon. That's coming up in like... Three weeks? Yeah. Three weeks. Three weeks. Check yeah. us out next week. I guess we'll And then don't forget really. to check out uh, next Wednesday. Yeah. Next Wednesday? That's next, right. Next Wednesday for next the, Wednesday. Um, the uh, putting the screws on. Put yeah. On it's not Wednesday. It's Wednesday after. The Wednesday after July 25th. Yeah. And then, so if you want to win, some, if you win some of those tickets, remember, just hashtag put the screws on.
And we will get you out we'll to see that tickets. show last Wednesday at Grindstone Theater. Yeah. And uh, I think that's Wednesday, all we got PM. for this week. So, hey, thanks for having us again. Thanks uh, for we'll, coming We're going to definitely come back. Uh, maybe not even when we're shooting the show, just hanging out yeah. and trying our costumes. Yep. But yeah, check them out at Carrie's Costumes for all your costume needs, rentals, and purchases. We're in St. Albert. In St. Albert. And you can check them out on Facebook. And see you next week. Same nerd time, same nerd channel. I'm Ron. Watch. I'm Carl. I'm Joss for the watch. Bye, I'm Joss. For the watch. <laughs> I, got I have the power. <laughs>